My name is Matthew Odell, and I guess this is what I do. I've been boxing since like early December, late November 2022. I feel as if it's been like the best decision of my life. Generally, I feel like boxing has saved my life. You know, I've definitely been through some hard times in my life and I feel as if boxing has just really helped me. Like since I've started, I've just been such, I don't know, I feel like I've just I've really found myself. I feel as if boxing has given me a purpose in my life which I didn't feel as if I had one before and you know I wasn't I wasn't the best when I first started no one is like genuinely but you know I just kept working you know I'm always training bro I'm always, like I'm always training I'm always boxing like I'm always running or I'm like at the gym lifting bro I'm always working you know to try and bear myself that's all I really want to do nowadays <laughs> This guy! I can't believe he's tripping! Why is he tripping? Why is he tripping? <laughs> Alright then guys, so this is... Alright then guys, so around me now is the uh, school gym. Me and my friends come here like very often. I come here to get the muscle work in, get that strength and conditioning at all times. You know, just to bear myself because that's what, that's what I'm always doing. Uh, even if my friends don't want to come, I'm still here working. You know, the graft is on. The graft is personal nowadays. So today I'm going to take you through my biceps and back workout because that's what we're working on. And who's coming in here? Come on now, come on in but he's got the speaker. So yeah, let me just show you around the gym and then we'll get our workout in. I'm not laughing. Back down now today, now onto the biceps. Let's go get it done. We've done already have these resistant bands. Make sure to get them. The pump on them is absolutely insane. I got mine for free as well off Team Who. Anyone knows who that is? Yeah. If, you don't, if you don't know, Get to know. Even for the people who are not even comfortable going to the gyms, get these in your house and genuinely you'll feel it. My biceps have gone flayed up so much since I've been doing this. Alright then, I'm gonna show you through the whole workout that I did today. So we started off with back, that worked out here, yeah. and then. So these two were here, I did uh, three sets of 12 on each of them. And then into the pull-ups, did three sets of eight, and then show to the biceps then. Three sets of 24, so 12 on each hand, no more. And then three sets of 24 again, so 12 each hand, and then the hammer curls. 
and then I went into the position bomb, which I already said. If you don't already have one, make sure you go get one. It's generally feeling much better when I have them now rather than when I didn't. So that's it. And also did the resistant ones. I went for a lower weight. Like that. Like that. I did three sets of eight like that. So yeah, I'm working hard. I have a goal. I'm doing all the work that I have to to go achieve my goal. I'm working here, working with the boys, getting that working, and generally, I'm coming for all. Just for a joke with the boys, yeah. All the boys gonna punch me in the stomach as hard as they can. I don't recommend this at all because uh, it's conditioning, but you're not meant to go all out. On conditioning for boxing, you're meant to just do the light taps, not proper. Uh, for a laugh with the boys. I'm the one who asked them to do this now, so they're not abusive. I asked them to do it. So they're gonna get their hardest points each on my belly and let's see if I can firm it. Alright, it's my good friend here, Alfie. I'll be giving some battle. Alright, anyway, I haven't even explained to him yet, but basically I'm gonna stand here and you, yeah, you are going to absolutely full force into my stomach. Right hand. What would you rather? Right hook? Or right straight. Right up. Alright, stand there. Alright, alright. If he damages me now, it's my fault. I make big choice in the not 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 for this. So if you don't like going first, like my summer's already red. Alright, and now four 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 four. Big choice there now. <laughs> uh, see that? Balance guys. I'm coming for all. I can take punches like that. Show him the <laughs> Look at him. His hands to me. He's hurting oh me. He's more than me. That's a lie. I'm in pain right now, but you can't let your opponent. Come on, Lemo. You can't let your opponent see that you're in pain. I'm sure him left up, yeah? Yeah. Alright. This boy is clumsy, so he's gonna accidentally punch me in the balls or something. Don't do it, alright? Make sure. Yeah, see, I'm throwing my red right really now. Right, so you're gonna left up, is it? Yeah. Get, get, get like a light punch going through. Alright, right, now full force, literally guarantee. I go on a high, I don't want to lower. Right. Oh! Ah! I'm an animal, boys. I'm a fucking oh, animal. Double. Know, chuck things at you that you don't always want and it's just really annoying and in my case I had a thumb injury my left thumb which just stopped me from training for a decent while all right then seven days until the first fight it's looking good yeah I'm feeling ready I'm feeling prepared <coughs> one week out I've trained for this I want this but this happened all right I've had it for the past like two weeks. It's not getting better. It's still gonna be bad on fight day and I know that. I haven't been able to spar much recently. Didn't spar at all in training today. To be honest, I've just been making it worse and it's not lucky and good, bruv. But it's always, I've got to fight through the pain, you know. I'm gonna record again now. When I ice it, cause I've been icing it non-stop. You know, I don't, don't even know if it's helping at this point because there's no like a bruise anymore. It's like I've sprained it. So, spring thumb, I'm fighting next week. No more sparring. Today was the last sparring, but let's see what happens. Let's see what happens. But I ain't no pussy, I ain't back in it. No thumb injury is stopping me. Alright, I'm in bed. I'm icing my thumb. I right, press that down on now. But yeah, it's not looking good for my thumb, but I'm just hoping that adrenaline gets me through. And yeah, I've trained for this, I've trained very hard for this. I want this. So I'm just gonna have to wait and see. No more boxing now really after the fight because I don't wanna make it worse than it already is. But I'm still gonna keep up with my fitness obviously. But yeah. Just can't wait to get in there, but <clears throat> Alright then, got some news. Today is Wednesday. My fight's Friday. But unfortunately, my fight has been called off. The whole event has been shut down, bro. I'm absolutely gutted. Um, I was really hoping to get out there and show everyone what I can do. But pff, my brother, it is 
for this. No, I can't do anything about it now. But um, new fight date should um, be released soon, so it's going to be in the same place. Um, but yeah, just a different date now. I'm absolutely gutted because I feel like I put a lot of time into this. But it's what it is, bro. It is what it is. Uh, you know, stuff like this you just gotta deal with and move on and get on with it. And I gotta think of it as a positive, you know, it gives me more time to prepare now. Um, even though I feel like I had plenty of time and I'm definitely ready. But it just gives me that extra, extra little bit of a boost, my brother. And uh, yeah, and also, hopefully the thumb is fully recovered then, because it's very badly messed up. I would have fought through the pain, but... You know, hopefully my thumb is fully recovered by then. But yeah, the whole event's been shut down. Nobody, the 15 fights are going to happen and not happening now. And they're happening on a different day. So whenever I find out when that day is, I'll let you know. This thing has been like just over, why am I looking? Just over like two months of this thumb injury and I'm still not fully recovered. But it's definitely a bit better now. And it's December the 8th today. I'm still training hard as hell, bro. I'm putting all that work in, I'm telling you. I'm just using my right hand at the moment, which is unfortunate, but do what you can in there. And that's exactly what I'm doing. I'm doing what I can all the time. And I'm looking to go back in the new year. This moment right now is nine o'clock and I was meant to fight around nine o'clock. So right this moment right now, if the event didn't get canceled, I'd have been fighting. And it's hitting deep, bro. It is really upset and I can't lie. But it's what it is. Whenever the reschedule, I'm coming in strong and I'm coming for it all. May the 5th was my last day of school, as in... Oh, bro. Alright, so May the 5th was my last day of school, as in... It wasn't the last day, but it was the last day until, like... It was the last full day of school, which means we'd only come in like for our exams after that. <laughs> Why is my... Oh, I don't know. That's perfect. All right. I understand that my room's a mess right now, but um, we don't care. Sorry, ma'am. I know you're watching this right now and you're going to be very mad at me, but uh, it doesn't matter. So we have some dodgy things on my back. God knows what it says. Um, I'm going to take my top off now. Try not to get too excited. Yeah, and that night, so May the 5th, my dad takes me to go watch an entertainment basketball game, which me and my dad had an absolutely brilliant time, you know, really good. And then I come home all happy, I open the front door, come through the living room, and I just see my mother bawling out crying. And, and to this day, I don't know, it was the worst sight I've seen in my life, as in, I hope to never see my mother like that again. You know, it was the hardest thing for me seeing her like that. And then she tells me that my nan has passed away. So we used to call her Nani. So Nani passed away. My nan. So my nan and her mother just passed away that night. So my day was going brilliant then. Now that's down as like the worst day like of my life. I didn't know what to do because I've never been in this situation before and I've never something like this has never happened to me, you know. I, I didn't know what to do. I was lost and then I went straight outside and then bro I just every built up emotion of that moment all got taken out on the punching bag bro. Outside I went straight down. I think it was bare knuckled, you know, I think I swear I almost broke my wrist. But just genuinely started beating the absolute crap out of the punching bag, yeah. And I think at that moment I knew I wanted to be a boxer and everything that I do in my life now will be to make her proud.